Hello there. And welcome to another passive breakdown starring, Wu Fei, the Crimson Gale. Let's get to it. And while you are at it, subscribe for more contents like this. Wu Fei has multiple passives that is based around her skill and gadgets, and is based on what equipments she is using. Starting off with Wu Fei's dodge passive, you are able to fire bolts from her wrist bow when you dodge, meaning one dodge is equal to one bolt, a dodge with a slash is equal to two bolts, two slash dodge is equal to three bolts, three slash dodge is equal to four bolt. Her max slash combo is four slashes, so four slash dodge is equal to five bolts. You cannot stack them, you cannot save them, or delay its release, and you have to immediately use it after her normal slash attack combo. Up next in the chopping block is her Crimson Archblade passive. If bolts that are in motion that were fired either skill or dodge passive makes contact with her Archblade it will split into multiple projectile fragments that is useful for crowd fighting but it will have lesser damage. On a side note, you cannot have multiple Archblades to split more bolts because once they are split they are considered projectiles fragments. Jumping to the next skill is her Wormtail Lash, that has its own passive, the Vermilion Shadow mark. You can kick the Archblade that is still in flight to extend its duration indefinitely if you keep kicking. You can use the first skill with first style plus moving direction and time it perfectly to extend and launch the arc blade further. You can also use the style 2-2 and time it with direction so you have better control with the direction of the arc blade will be. And with the recent hotfix, they've added an indicator on where the arc blade will go to when it's about to return. But, reminders to players that will just let the arc blade fly, it will eventually fall if you just let it fly. Flying to the next skill passive is the Willow Piercer Bow. It has its own passive, the bolts from this skill pierce through enemies, but when combined with the Vermilion Shadow mark, bolts that hit enemies is guaranteed to crit. But only when using this skill, and not the dodge bolts. With the right soul blends and play style, players will be efficient and have fun with this new hero. That is all for this video. Be sure to check out Hu Yufeng's passive breakdown in this other video. Feel free to comment if you have other tips for other players to see. Thanks and have fun.